Hi, this video is from interview.com. Interview.com is a job portal. In this video, I'm going to talk about stack overflow error in Java. Before that, let's see what is stack memory. Stack memory is used to store the local variables and function call. Each thread in Java has their own stack, which can be specified using minus XSS JVM parameter. If there is no memory left in the stack memory for storing function call or local variable, Java virtual machine that is JVM will throw java.lang.stack overflow error. Variables stored in stacks are only visible to the owner thread. So for each thread, a stack will be allotted and in inside the stack, local variables will be stored and whenever this allotted stack get exhausted, then you will be getting stack overflow error. How can I reproduce this? I can use a recursive method, a typical way of reproducing this error. So I can have a recursive method and I, I will be keep on calling that method and the allotted stack memory will be getting exhausted. Let's see this. I have written a simple program. So a recursive method I will be keep on calling and inside that I am creating a string. So I am going to start the debugging now. Let's see how exactly it's going to work. So if you see here this recursive method so many times it has called. Can you see this? So many times it has called and we have got this stack overflow error. It's not recommended to catch stack overflow error for demo purpose. I am catching it so that you can see. So it has called this method so many times and it has got stack overflow error. How do I avoid this? If you want to avoid you have to properly terminate this recursive method otherwise you will be getting stack overflow error hope this video is useful thank you and all the best